up welcome to my channel today's video is another Kmart hair styler review video this one has gone somewhat viral this is the LCD hair straightener um, that is being compared to a GHD and I guess a cloud nine you can't really compare it to one and not the other so I'm gonna do three videos on this one I'm gonna do the review of just the product by itself so you can see how I use it and then we're gonna do it versus the GHD and also versus the cloud nine so you can see how it compares now this was $27 New Zealand I will put on the screen how much that is US and also in pounds so you guys can see that um, but it's by Anco is the brand LCD hair straightener it's pretty basic packaging so it's got one hour of auto off protection adjustable temperature control up to 230 degrees Celsius it's ceramic coated floating plates and LCD digital temperature display that's all it says so the actual straighteners themselves are quite pretty I was surprised by how they felt to be honest they are they feel just like normal hair straighteners they feel quite long I don't know if they compare how they compare to the GHDs and the cloud nines I feel like they're longer but I'd have to line them up to see this is where the LCD screen is and then you've got the on off button here and then the temperature control and then um, yeah that's pretty much it it's got the swivel cord and then the cord looks like it's about I don't know, two meters long, maybe 1.5 meters, I'm not sure. I'm terrible with uh, measurements. So that's pretty much it. It's a nice rose goldy. Is it even rose gold? It's like an off. <laughs> I guess it's kind of rose gold. It's less, a little less pink than that though, isn't it? It's more like copper and black. So it's very stylish looking. Obviously, the only thing I can do here, it's about as much as I can talk about the product, is straighten my hair. So I'm going to go ahead and do that for you. Okay, so I've just put my uh, mirror in front of me. I've got the hair straighteners here. I'll turn them on in front of the camera. I'm just going to put my uh, heat protectant on and I've got two clips to do my hair as well. So I'm just going to go ahead and do that. Okay, so turning it on, I suppose it's going to be pretty straightforward. Yep, so you can see on the front here, I don't know if you guys can actually see this. Okay, so that's the temperature gauge there. You can see there's a lock on this, so I'm just going to hold this down and it seems to unlock it. So I'm going to take it up to 210 because I feel like, I don't know, I'm not going to take it all the way to 230, I'm just going to put it on 210 for now. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and just start straightening my hair, I guess. I always tend to like part it there right where my ear is and get rid of the stuff around my face because I tend to spend a bit more time on that. So just taking a section of hair on 210, it says it's ready on there as well and the lock's on it again, that picture of the lock. Yep, that is pretty bloody straight chat. Yeah? <laughs> Jesus, the hell? Sweet baby cheeses. Can you guys see how straight that is? So obviously I went over twice. It is pin straight. The only thing I could say is it feels like it tugs a little bit, but it's not tugging as such. It just, um, I don't know how to explain this. Let me just have it a few more goes and I'll try to explain what I'm talking about. Grab another section. Oh my God, I'm so impressed. What the heck? Ah! It doesn't feel super hot as well, like my hair cools down straight away, and it is pin straight. What the actual? Let me just try, I'm just going to try a bigger section, just to really test it. It's obviously got very wide, um, like long plates as well. The actual heck. Oh, this is very interesting. <laughs> I like to go over like this usually with my other straighteners, but I feel like I only need to do it like once more with this one. What the hell? It feels so nice as well. Like it doesn't feel like, um, I was worried it was going to burn my hair and make it feel quite dry or like, I don't know. I don't know what I was expecting really. My hair's just washed this morning as I said, and it's just got that product. So there's no natural oils or anything in here. But I'd hate to know. <laughs> what 230 does what the hell okay maybe I'll do like I'll do 230 on this side I really don't want to but I know you guys are probably wondering what 230 looks like I'm just like shocked it's quite effortless like even though the only thing the only comment is is that tugging like I don't know if you can 
that's the only thing that's kind of like what is that sound and like why is it making that noise it's almost just like not as smooth and silky to pull through your hair as when you buy like GHDs and stuff for the first time but the straightness is a hundred percent amazeballs like I'm just like shocked like for $27 come on like that is quite the comparison I'm amazed okay so we're gonna turn it up to 230 definitely does not need it I just want to see oh, I really don't want to see actually but just because I know that a lot of people will be like put it on 230 so I'm doing it I'm terrified it smells a little bit like plastic but it seems to have got less since I started using it so that's a good sign I suppose <laughs> 230 degrees let's go I'm terrified chat What? That is pin. Pin straight. What the actual? Okay, grabbing a bigger section. I'll try and move you guys this way so you can see a bit better. Okay, this is quite a big section. That one's a lot hotter, but it's not too bad. It just, like... Is straightening my hair like magic. What the actual? You can see my doors over my cat did it. I don't really know if there's like, I'm just impressed. I can already tell you guys that I'm going to be picking this up again. I've got two, I've got the GHD and the Cloud9. As I said, I will do a comparison video, this between the two, but. like what okay just so you guys can see what I'm doing on this side so I'll just do this bit here can you guys see what do chat what do it's just that tugging that's the only comment I've got the tugging it's not a tug like this you can't like feel it as such you can feel it in your hand on the product, like on the um, straightener, and you can hear it, but you can't feel it in your hair if that makes sense. It's really hard to explain. I can't not comment on it, but my hair, like what? <laughs> I'm stoked. This is very cool. Very cool. I love finding, and I just held the button to turn it off. I love finding stuff that actually works. It's so affordable. Now, I don't know. Like, there's probably going to be lots of people that say, you know, it's better to use the GHDs or Cloud 9s because it's made of all these different things and it's got, like, all these different features and stuff that are better for your hair. But not everybody can afford those. And to get such straight hair from a $27 hair straightener, I'm stoked. My hair feels nice. It feels... Just feels good. Like, I'm just... So shocked. I just need to get these little bits here. God, I hate baby hair. Um, I am very shocked, like shocked. I'm very happy. I have bought a few products in the past from Kmart and the heat didn't even get anywhere near what it needed to to straighten my hair. So definitely would say buy this and try it. It's $27. What have you got to lose? Probably a good one just to have on hand in case the other ones break down or if you want like a traveling set or just an additional pair of hair straighteners. I'm just like, yeah. You guys can see it, like what else am I meant to say? I really love this. Like I do not regret my decision to buy it. And in fact, gonna call it now, I would say, cause I've got old GHDs and old Cloud 9s. Um, this gets my hair straighter than they do now. So, yep. Yeah. I. I don't know how they compare to brand new ones. I'm gonna compare them to my current ones. So yeah, I'm just, I got nothing else to say. Love it, do not regret this purchase. I think it is great. 100% would say go try them because again, like we've got nothing to lose. Um, I would love to see if anyone's got super curly hair, how it, well it does for you. Definitely put hair um, protectant on because it's not, um, I don't think these are as good for your hair. Like you obviously straightening your hair is not good at all, but the more expensive ones do have better technology so i would say definitely use a lot of the hair protectant but otherwise i'm stoked i'm so stoked tell me down below what you guys think keep an eye out for the ghd comparison and the cloud nine comparison as well um they will be up uh 
I guess later on in the week and also the following so subscribe if you want to see that kind of content let me know down below if there's anything else you want me to try and test I'm going to keep doing like the as seen on TVs and just random reviews so fire them in tell me what you want to see I'm keen to buy stuff and uh, save you money by reviewing it first or making you buy bulk tons if it's a really successful product I don't know <laughs> but anyway guys thank you so much for watching I hope you enjoyed and I will see you in the next video